What's up, everybody? Joe White here, and I, I want to talk about something that uh, I I follow uh, a lot of people here on YouTube. I subscribe to a lot of people, one of which is the Glenn and Friends cooking channel. Uh, Glenn is a Canadian um, who does cooking videos. And he has a background in advertising. That's where he gets all of his audio and video equipment from. Um, that's why his stuff looks so good. And recently, uh, today actually, he uploaded a video talking about how he normally does not do ads in his videos. He normally does not do sponsors in his videos. Uh, he used to way, way back in the day, but he doesn't anymore. And now he's saying that he has to because um, it he doesn't make enough money from his videos to continue producing his videos. Um, my thing is this. YouTube is not a job. YouTube, is at least for me, YouTube has never been a job. YouTube will never be a job. I have a skill. I can drive an 80,000 pound vehicle down the road without killing anybody else or myself. Um, and I think I do the job quite well. But, you know, I record these videos for you guys with a wireless headset or wireless earbuds. Either while I'm stopped at night on my 10 hour break. Or when I'm rolling down the road. Um, and then I edit them together. On a free video editing software. On my phone. I have a Samsung Galaxy S22. I think that's what this is. Hold on. Yeah, Galaxy S22. And I got to pay that cell phone bill. Regardless of what my job is, I have to, you know, it's unlimited data, so it doesn't cost me anything to upload it. It does not cost me anything to record this video. Wireless earbuds, I, I found a pair of JBL wireless earbuds. That's what I use. I got them for 50 bucks. So... How my question is how is it costing anybody to produce a YouTube video? Now, quality may be an issue for you. Oh, I want the best possible quality, and the best possible quality I can requires me to go buy a three thousand dollar camera. Well, I would suggest that you go out and you flip enough burgers to earn you that three thousand dollars. Get it honestly. Don't give in to, oh, I, it, the, the fact that you people say it costs you money to make a video is downright astounding to me. I wish somebody would explain it to me. YouTube is free. It, it, it I have this, you, YouTube does not charge me anything to have my channel. It's free. Now, I don't know how their ad system works. I don't know how frequently you get an ad during one of my videos. I don't care. I'm never going to make money off this. I don't know if I ever want to make money off this. I've had several now. The channel, since it has gotten over 500 subscribers, which thank each and every one of you very much, and if you haven't subscribed yet, it, you know, hit the subscribe button. Just because I want you to keep hearing what I have to say. I don't have a sponsor. I don't have overhead. I don't have a, a budget. The only thing I have is time. And for somebody like Glenn and Friends, I, you know, he, he's not, if you've watched his channel, the man went and bought an airplane for crying out loud. You don't go buy and fix up an airplane if you're not, kind of well off to begin with. I'm not well off enough to buy an airplane. 
I'm not well off to go buy, you know, thousands upon thousands of dollars worth of equipment. Mainly because I got better things I can do with my money. Okay? As far as the food costs go for a cooking channel, you got to eat anyway, don't you? Why not just show what you're having for dinner that night and videotape it? Cell phones nowadays make really good video recording. I can record in 4K on my phone. Editing software, I, I, I know it's not the best in the world, but I use a program called UCut. It's free. It's mobile. So I don't get when, when these YouTubers say, it's costing me money to make videos for you. Here's an inside trip. Here's an inside piece of uh, information, if you will. It does not cost me anything to make this video. This video is free. Enjoy it. Only thing it's costing me is a couple minutes of my time. Yeah, I could be sleeping or I could be playing video games or planning out my next trip if they would give me one. And I make sure to prioritize my work in driving this truck over YouTube. But I don't get the whole, it costs me money to make videos deal. You got to pay your electric bill, whether you use your camera, your stove, whatever the case may be or not. You got to, you know, I have to pay my cell phone bill. Because I need a phone to work. To do my regular job. And here's, here's the rub. Here's the rub. For those of you who make money doing YouTube. It's all tax deductible. If you don't think these people like a Logan Paul or 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 that ridiculousness, whatever that whatever that channel is where they throw stuff off a bridge to hit a trampoline, whatever the case, I mean any any YouTube channel that does this for a living. If they're smart, they're saving their receipts and they're writing everything off from the clothes they wear to, you know, I, I, when I was, uh, working from, when I was working from home, I bought a PlayStation 5 or PlayStation 4, PlayStation 4. Guess what? You can write that off on your taxes. If you can get news and weather on it, you can, and it's, and it's in your office, you can write it off on your taxes. Your computer, any upgrades that you do to your computer, tax write-off. Like Dave Meltzer, take Dave Meltzer. You think he actually pays for all those wrestling pay-per-views that he has to order? You think he pays for his New Japan subscription? You think he pays for his Peacock subscription? No, at the end of the year, it's all tax deductible. As long as you can prove that you use it for work purposes, it's all tax deductible. Now, I know that years ago, truck drivers, oh my Lord, I'll, I'll, I'll share a little secret with you. The first year I ever got into trucking, I kept every receipt that I could. From the underwear that I bought, to the socks on my feet, to the shirts on my back, I wrote it all off. And the federal government also allowed you at that time a $35 a day per diem for meals. You write all that off. I think I ended up getting an $8,000 return one year because I saved all my receipts and stuff. And if you think these YouTubers aren't doing the same, then, then you, you're delusional. So this stuff about it costs me money to make a video. Wake up. It doesn't really cost them anything at the end of the day. Because every bit of equipment they buy is tax deductible. So I wish somebody would explain to me, other than time, what is it costing you? Because you're going to get your money back in the end. 
Anyway, folks, if you see a big rig on the road, let us over if we need to get over. Give us lots of room out here. Don't tailgate us. Go the speed limit. If you can't see our mirrors, we can't see you, and we will see you down the road.